This is the result of the discharge of nuclear wastes into the sea. Various kinds of deformed creatures were made into food. Even though those creatures looked very disgusting and inedible. This guy couldn't control himself and took a bite. I find this disgusting but I can't help myself. After seeing the teeth, he came up with an idea. Very quickly, he constructed a pistol from the inedible parts. He then pretended to point the gun at the woman, making her completely dumbfounded. In fact, they were staying in the virtual world. This guy's name is Ted, he's a publicist, who feels interested in the latest virtual reality game. And the woman is Allegra, game designer. On that day, when Allegra was demonstrating her latest invention existence, among the fanatics, she selected 12 people from them as players to experience the new game. But right when they just entered the game, an extremist shot Allegra in the shoulder with an organic pistol. He started the murder. Kill Allegra, he shouted out. The scene immediately became chaotic. Even though the assassin was gunned down, the staff learned that there were still other assassins in the hall. Before dying, he entrusted Ted with the task of escorting Allegra outside. Halfway, Ted helped her take the bullet out which turned out to be a tooth. They both felt very puzzled. Allegra suspected that there were insiders in her company. After that, they traveled to a gas station. Allegra discovered that her pod, which contained the only copy of existence, might be damaged. So she came here to find a black marketeer named Gas. Ted wanted to help Allegra test the game's integrity. He was going to have a bioport installed in his spine. Right when Gas saw Allegra, he knelt down. You changed my life, he said. But she ignored it and asked him to help Ted. After having a bioport inserted into his spines, Ted felt exhausted. But everything can happen beyond expectation. You destroy the bioport, shouted Allegra. After that, Gas showed his true colors. He admitted deliberately installing a faulty bioport. And revealed his intention to kill Allegra for the bounty. The injured couple were on the verge of dying. A group of fanatics called realists had offered a reward for whoever killed Allegra. The reward for killing her was $5 million. At the critical moment, a bullet flew into Gas's neck. It was Ted who promptly saved her life. The two escaped to a former ski lodge used by Vinegar, Allegra's mentor, who was expert at science and technology. Vinegar and his assistant repaired the damaged pod. Ted discovered that the controller was created by amphibian fertilized eggs, the nervous system of deformed creatures. After that, he was given a new bioport. Together, they entered the game and reached the first layer of the virtual world. At this place, the space wasn't any different from the real world. Ted found many suspicious things in the game. What precisely is the goal of the game that we're playing now? You have to play the game to find out why we're playing the game. He could only accept his fate and continue. The two met with Darcy Nader, a video game shop owner, who provided them with new micropods. But as soon as it reached the controller, it crawled into their bodies. The couple then entered a deeper layer of the game. They assumed new identities as workers in a game pod factory where Ted met another worker, Nourish, and was recommended to a Chinese restaurant. You'd better order their speciality. Ted took Allegra to the restaurant. We want to order the special dish. Which made the people in the restaurant start to doubt. I feel like I'm disconnected from the real world. He shouted loudly and got out of the game. Allegra kissed and convinced him to return to existence. At the same time, in the virtual world, the special dish was already served. Ted was controlled by the game and shoveled food into his mouth. After that, he created a pistol with the bones and shot the waiter, which made him enraged and took out a knife to kill Ted. Ted shot again and killed the waiter. At this time, they encountered Nourish again. Excellent. You won this round. It turned out that what had just happened was just an experiment. Nourish then took the two to the back garden, where he revealed his true identity as a realist, and that this fish farm was actually the base where the controller was created. Not long after this, he would destroy both the farm and the controller. Therefore, he wanted the couple to return to cortical systematics. You've proved that you're the realists. Ted pretended to agree with Nourish. After that, the pair returned to the game store and found Nader. Because they doubted that he had sold her identity to the realists. Only to know that Nader had been comatose. And the cashier named Hugo Carla, who took over his position was a realist. You shouldn't have killed that Chinese waiter. The worker informed them. That Nourish was actually a double agent for cortical systematics. And the waiter was the actual contact. Hearing so, the couple were completely speechless. They returned to the factory. And found a diseased pod. Allegra connected it to her bioport, planning to infect the other pods and sabotage the factory. Very quickly, she became ill. Ted cut the umbicord. 
but she began to bleed to almost death. At the critical moment, Nourish turned up. He used a flamethrower to burn the diseased pod. Allegra immediately cut the connectors and managed to return to the real world. After that, Allegra discovered that Ted's game pod was diseased. So she inserted a disinfecting device into Ted's bioport. Suddenly, a realist broke in. He destroyed the connectors. Seeing that her invention was destroyed in a flash. Allegra went crazy. Ted could only drag her away to escape. But at this time, the realists had surrounded the house. Very quickly, they were captured. At the critical moment, Vinegar arrived and shot the realist in the back. He also informed Allegra that he had copied her game data while fixing her pod. It turned out that he was also a double agent. Allegra then vengefully killed Vinegar. Ted was frightened of Allegra's cruelty and decided to tell her the truth. It was no accident we ended up on the run together. Ted then revealed that he was a realist sent to kill her. Allegra also admitted that she had known his intentions. Since Ted pointed the gun at her in the Chinese restaurant. After that, Allegra killed the betrayer. Death to the demon Ted Pickle. Have I won? Suddenly, Ted and Allegra are seated in chairs in a small abandoned church. Which is actually the real world. They're all the players who are testing the game. After that, Ted and Allegra become a real couple. But they're now obsessed with the game and become the realists. They aim the guns at the staffs. Don't you think you should suffer for the harm you've done to human race? The people around are completely dumbfounded. Hey tell me the truth. Are we still in the game? It's the end of the movie. Thank you for watching. Goodbye and see you in other videos.